really excited about today because we're talking about one of my favorite topics, and that is uh, Franciacorta. And who better to have talk about my favorite subject than one of my favorite people, and that is uh, Gian Mario Villa, who's here. He's the official ambassador for the region of Franciacorta. And we're going to have some fun today. We're going to learn a little bit about Franciacorta. We're going to sip a little bit uh, on the wines. And we're going to talk a little bit about the lifestyle that this wonderful uh, beverage inspires. So welcome, Gemario. Thanks so much for joining Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I'm, I'm super excited. Every time I can join you in particular, <laughs> I am really happy. Uh, I'm really happy to represent a, a wonderful region of Italy, a, a, a wonderful way of celebrating life now that everything is reopening. We are seeking for uh, more reason to toast and also to have a friendly chat about Francia Corta. We don't want to be too technical. We want to just inspire on discovering something new or learn more about what you might like better and most importantly uh, dream through our uh, stories uh, and our personal memories about Francia Corte by our I mean both me and Christian and you were you were just in uh, Francia Corte not too long ago right I was there just uh, very recently actually uh, uh, a little over two weeks ago I was uh, roaming in the fields of Francia Corte uh, you know, it's easy to talk about how beautiful are the landscape back in Italy and France, Spain, the old world. This is magical, especially after two years of um, of being forced to stay in the country. But when I when I had the chance to go back uh, in the north, and we're going to talk a moment about you know some geographical aspect of Francia Corta, but I was surrounded by the mountains, by the lake, by the vineyards. People were happy again. Everybody was putting their, their heart first, literally, uh, seeking for a reason to connect and to talk about Francia Corta. So it was a very inspiring and very emotional under many uh, different points of views. I can imagine, I can imagine. Well, why don't, we, why don't we do this? Why don't we get started off? I know you, uh, you can kind of set the stage. You have a great presentation for us. We'll set the stage of Francia Corta um, and talk a little yep. bit about it. And then we'll come back, we'll taste through the wines and we'll have a great discussion around um, around your experiences in in the region, uh, as well as Absolutely. what what foods and and uh, pair wonderfully with these with these wines. So I'm going to go ahead and switch the screen. If you want to share your screen, we will. I think um, we are right here. Great. So excellent. The floor is yours. The floor is yours. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Um, so well, I, I, I add a few new slides and some new content after my trip to Francia Corta, and I was debating if I wanted to change the first the cover of the presentation, but this image here, even if I know some of our viewers are recorded viewers and they, they already attended a couple of our tasting, but I couldn't take this away. Uh, and this is extremely meaningful to give you an idea of uh, what is around you when you're in Francia Corta. This is the, the, the local regional park of Sibino. You see the mountains, the pre-Alps, uh, and the background with some snow. Uh, this is most likely a, a November uh, photo, or no longer than that. So, and this vineyard surrounding what was back in the days, the path of the glacier coming down from north and we're going to talk about that in a, in a moment so uh let's let's dive into this um starting by some more uh photos and uh, it's incredible how you can take a bicycle or ride a horse and and uh go around the vineyards of francia corta and get lost into a little forest nearby the lake um, you s always have a, um, a sort of a chorus around you there is not one single element dominating uh, the scene. It's not only about the mountain, it's not only about the lake, it's, it's this beautiful microenvironment characterized by multiple notes that make this fantastic symphony that's in Francia Corta. And uh, a less of a formal slide here, uh, um, this year we were exclusive partner in the category of sparkling wines with the Emmys, and I, I, I had to take this hard job and, and go for parties and take photos and most importantly talk about the French support. We, we had a blast. 